Dear student, in the previous chapter we have studied about plant, its part and functions. In this chapter number 2, we will study about the useful plant and animals. As you can see in the picture, lot of things are depicted as furnitures made of wood, okay, plant which we are we are getting and the cotton you can see and the cloth we are getting from the cotton balls and many other things you can find at home also and here in the picture you can see that eggs are laid by duck hen and the milk we are getting from the cow so can list the 10 materials around you at home which are made from plant and you we are getting from animals okay make a list of this the food which we are getting we are getting from the grains as you can see here there are the cereals like plant uh, paddy wheat and maize they are providing us these cereals and which are very much useful for our growth for growth of the body and the peas beans as you can see in the picture pulses are obtained from such plants as you are daily using it i think we get protein from the dal so for the healthy body and healthy mind mind we should we must take balanced diet as you are aware of it so we are getting lot of useful things from the plants and animals and the vegetable oil like peanut oil sunflower or mustard oil we are getting from the plants do you know what is fodder fodder is the food grass which animals eat like cow goat sheep you can see in the picture they are eating they are called fodder some of the other animals like poultry animals like hen duck these are given special food okay and these animals uh, uh, eat also so food that animals eat also come from plant animals are dependent on plant directly or indirectly for their food besides giving us food plant are also useful for many other ways as you can see here in the picture a lot of things are shown like boat made from wood and matchbox is also made and the hockey and cricket bat as you are playing so a lot of things you can find out made of wood and plant like paper you are writing your notebook and book these are all made from the plant parts okay not only this plants gives us medicine also like most of you have planted tulsi plant i hope and neem trees all around you in the colony so you can see that the medicine uh, we are, can also get from the plant and its part so charak and dhanvantri were the famous ayurvedic practitioners they were the doctors you can say that ancient medical practitioners of ayurveda like ayush can you tell me the full form of ayush find out and write in your copy now tulsi and uh, tulsi leaf these are added in the tea like uh, during cough and cold and we get uh, cure from the throat problem and uh, Banafsa leaf are also used for the treatment of cough and cold. Cough. So, these type of the plant, these are very much useful. Like Pudin Hara also you might have planted at your home. So, this is very good for our health and serves as the medical purpose as a medicine. And the bark of the sun trees also are very much useful. We are getting gum from the rubber tree and the milk which is obtained is called latex. These are collected and they are made hard by adding sulfur to the latex obtained from the rubber plant. You must have seen rubber plant. Can you find out where is the rubber plant in our lo locality? Okay, find out. Now other uses of the plant. For example, cotton obtained from plant which is used for making cloth. And we get perfume and scent from the flower. Bees collect nectar from the plant and make honey and we get uh, gum and resin from the plant rubber is also made from the plant as i told earlier and uh, plant waste make good manure like uh, the vegetable peel and the waste uh, the leaf which are falling on the ground they make manure when they are collected in a pit 
then uh, they become compost and very much useful for the growth of the plant okay so try to make a pit and make compost of it i hope you are able to do it take your help of your parent for the same so not only this we get lot of many other things like honey we get from the plant as uh, all the honey bees they are collecting from the different type of the flower and we get it and perfume you can see you have been using perfume so that it is very much aromatic and gives us good feeling now other than that you can see that the use there are a lot of other uses of the animals like elephant they carry logs okay heavy wooden part is called log which is collected by which is can be transported from one place to another uh, by elephant and uh, like cart bullock cart these are pulled by bulls and donkeys they are also carrying heavy loads from one place to other and uh, what is the shape of desert do you know camel correct so they are also used at different places as per their geographical conditions so they are very much useful for us and uh, like horse you can see here equestrian the person who is riding horse and the horses are also very much useful and uh, the animal which gives us milk can you name them okay and we get lot of other product by product from the milk like curd cheese cream butter and uh, we get ha this egg and meat from uh, duck and hens respectively and lot of other thing like here wool we are getting from the hair of the sheep and yak and the silk we are getting from the silk worm do you know the name of the culture what is that uh, the silk is produced that is called sericulture the process by which we are getting silk from the silk moth so later on you will find out the life cycle of the silk okay uh, so we can see that there are lot of other useful things we are getting from the plant uh, plant and animal and uh, the skin of the animals like cows and buffaloes these are cured to give us leather cured means they are processed by the chemical process they undergo and after the death of the animal these uh, skin are very much useful and we get lot of uh, product from this like uh, belt we are using and leather product and shoes bags football gloves as you can see here in the picture so these are the product we get from the leather of the animal and uh, uh, so you have to find out these things which you are getting from the plant and animal at your home and list them chalk out um, and uh, write it neatly read this chapter loudly okay i hope you have developed habit of reading uh, the chapter loudly daily at least for 10 to 15 minute okay so i hope it is clear to you so these are the natural resources which we are getting naturally from the plants and the animal we say it natural resource okay because they occur in nature and provide us so many useful things we must protect and take care of the nature so that it is useful for the next generation and everybody should be able to use it we must plant lot of trees so that uh, people get benefited from the plants and the animal because plant and animal both are interdependent of each other on each other directly or indirectly so we have to maintain the ecological balance okay so read this chapter loudly revise what you have understood in this chapter the usefulness of plants and animal and try yourself to do these questions like first question list five things which we can make out of wood and name three substances we get flower from flower flower i hope you are able to do it other than that you can see here the questions what are cereals you are aware of it the grains which we are getting as we have listed earlier and how do we get rubber you are aware can you tell me the name of the liquid which i told you yes latex and how we make it hard to make rubber eraser or tire of any vehicle that is sulfur is added in that okay now so you have to write about how we get rubber from rubber tree uh, cut mark is made on the rubber tree and we collect all the latex and that is very hard so like that you i hope you are able to understand this chapter and complete these question answers okay so 
complete it write it in your copy neatly and do the exercise question number one two match the column third fill in the blanks fourth write true or false for the statement okay if you have any problem you can ask me as per the time schedule i hope you are able to do it so as you can see here that true false plant often give us medicine this is true or false you are aware plant and animal do not depend on each other or depend we are aware of it they are depending dependent silk is obtained from plant or animal you know it better okay so do this and write uh, one use of each of the following uh, what we get from the sheep duck buffalo silk worm and yak okay so do this i hope you are able to complete it enjoy this chapter read it two three times and practice de develop re uh, habit of reading okay thank you very much